Hello everyone, I'm MVL and today we're doing a quick unboxing and a look at the new Nintendo Switch. Now I'm going to be opening this up and having a look at the contents and we'll also be checking if you can record the gameplay with a game capture. Here's a look at the front of the box and here we have the back. Okay, so let's open this up. So here we have the Nintendo Switch. This is the entire console in itself. On the back here you have this kickstand and that's where SD cards go for additional storage. The Joy-Cons attach on the side here. And the game cards go in the very top here. It's amazing to think at how powerful this system is, given the tiny size of this console. It fits right in the palm of your hand. It's not exactly um, incredibly portable. It wouldn't fit in your pocket. But it's very impressive to think that this is the entire console in itself. The Switch can, of course, be played as a portable or a home console. So that's the Switch. Let's see what else you get in here. Here are the Joy-Cons. This is the right Joy-Con. And here we have the left Joy-Con. They're fairly comfortable. I imagine the Pro Controller is a bit better. Uh, there's buttons on the sides. But there you go. Now these can slip into a Joy-Con grip to make a kind of dog face controller. Or they can slip into the sides of the console. Or you can use them by themselves. These controllers also have motion controls for Wii-like functions. They're a very advanced kit. Let's see what else we have in this box here. Uh, this looks like the Joy-Con grip. We also have a HDMI lead that comes in here. Power supply. This is a USB type C power supply and this is a regular UK plug. And this is a attachment for the Joy-Con which has a wrist strap in case you feel like it's going to come away from your hand. It gives you a little more purchase with those buttons on the side, makes them a little more pressable because as it stands those buttons are really small. A great thing about this system is it has local multiplayer right out of the box. And that leaves this, which must be the dock for the Nintendo Switch. The console slides into this uh, to get it onto your television. Over here at the back is where the AC goes in. The USB, this is a uh, USB 3.0 there. And we have HDMI out and there's a little cable organizer here you can use to sort your cables out. And that's about it. We've got uh, where it goes into on the front there. And oh, okay, we've got two more USB ports on the side here, but these look like USB 2.0s. I'm just going to quickly go over the contents here. So you've got your power lead, your HDMI lead. This is only two feet long. And then you have your left Joy-Con, your right Joy-Con. You have two wrist straps. I actually missed one of these when I was opening it. Your dock, your cradle for the controllers and you have the Switch itself. So here is the must-have game for the Nintendo Switch, Zelda Breath of the Wild. And uh, this reminds me of a PlayStation Portable case. So here's the comparison. They're just about the same size, but it is uh, actually a tiny bit thinner than a PlayStation Portable case. And of course these games come on these SD cards. It's quite nice that there's some artwork inside of there. They are, of course, SD cards and not cartridges. Here's a, a close-up of that. And here are the contacts on the back. Uh, allegedly, uh, these cartridges have been coated in anti-nail-biting chemicals to make them taste disgusting. Um, I am not going to lick the cartridge. I don't know why you would. Uh, but there you go. Uh, that's a measure to prevent you from swallowing them. Here's your switch on handheld mode. The screen looks actually a little bit better when you're in handheld mode. Uh, the resolution is a bit higher. It's kind of impressive. And now you're seeing the true gimmick in action. And now here we are 
with the game on the television. Now this is fantastic. So here we have some gameplay for the Nintendo Switch. This is being captured on my Elgato Game Capture. The gameplay from the Nintendo Switch is not encrypted. You can capture this, which is really good. Uh, that's really helpful. People like me, they like to record gameplay videos. So you can record gameplay on the Switch. Now this Zelda game graphically to me looks fantastic. Good reviews all across the board and this game just looks amazing. Uh, the visuals are stunning. There's loads of weapons, loads of different things to do. It looks very impressive. It looks great on the big screen and in handheld mode. I'm very impressed with this system all around. So there you have it. That's an unboxing. A little review of my first impressions for the Nintendo Switch. Please like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time.